Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Motorcycle Rewind. And today we're with the 1964 Honda 305 Dream. And the question I have, is this the most sophisticated motorcycle that Honda ever made? So when I, when I say the most sophisticated motorcycle ever made, I'm really talking about in this time period, you know, up till 1964, was this the most refined, sophisticated motorcycle they ever made? And I don't mean sophisticated by state-of-the-art, uh, state-of-the-art technology and the most forward focused. That's not what I'm talking about. I'm talking about for the individual, for the customer that it was after. Is this the most refined, sophisticated motorcycle that Honda's ever made? And guys, I'm willing to argue, and not, not argue, I'm willing to hear all of them. I'm not, I just have an opinion. And you know what my grandmama used to say about opinions. Uh, but what I mean by that is in 1964, you had talking about the big bike from the 305s the four talking about the the 305 scrambler super hawk and the dream and then the black bomb and identifying who those were for right? who they were after the scrambler for those rambunctious types that just like to go off-road willy-nilly wherever they want to go that's the first one that was the market they were going after. A very, very uh, distinct market they were going after. And then the Superhawk, a uh, sportier, still in the 305 range, but sportier going after that. People that wanted to go fast, that liked to watch their Speedo and their Tac go in opposite directions, trying to get them to meet the middle. And then you had the Dream. they had these people depicted as all oh, smartly dressed right you had him in a suit on like this guy's going about his day and that was the market right they, they were looking at it when, when you saw him on like a cub they were it was more leisurely and when you think of that this was just a refined bit of transportation it's smooth it's got super soft suspension so it's like riding a lazy boy This bike may that may be its kind of sweet spot if you will it's that refined motorcycle that Honda came out with in this time period for the refined palette you had this guy soft comfortable ride but just with a, a touch of class at least that's my thought. Let me know down below. Okay, let's get back to riding this sucker. <laughs> 